everybody, welcome back to another video. I'm Popo from Game here, and today I'm back in Cookie Run Kingdom. So, it's been a while since I've been here. Uh, I don't really know why. Uh, the last video I did on this game was almost a month ago, and it actually was on this new update, the Cookie Odyssey update, which isn't so new. It's now, you know, almost a month old. Uh, but it was really cool, I thought it was a really fun update, and then I just didn't play the game again, and I don't really know why. Uh, Bloom, my Bloom Adventure Time Tower Defense videos did really well right after that, and then I was playing CPT 6, which was fun. Uh, but I am back here. I don't know why I haven't played in so long. I really, really don't. And speaking of which, let's quickly just skip all of this, because why would we want to wait? Well, we can just have all of our buffs right now. That's a big waste, but I'm going to do it for time's sakes. That's not true. I'm going to use the one minutes now. Uh, but yeah, so I'm not really sure why I stopped playing this game, um, but... I wasn't quite sure what to do today, which has been a semi-common theme recently. Uh, struggling to come up with some video ideas, and I realized, hey, why don't I play some more Cookie Run Kingdom? Because it's been a long time. I think there's actually a new cookie since I last played two. Uh, they often do that where there's like a secondary cookie that comes with update. Uh, but I believe that is in the game officially. Um, so that's kind of cool. Uh, but yeah, so I'm hopefully just- I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna do today. I may end up doing some of the story, I may end up doing um, some of the Odyssey stuff, because I barely started with all that. I may try to get a new cookie. I really don't know. I'm gonna explore the game, see what's new. Uh, if you guys do want to see more Cookie and Kingdom videos in the future, please let me know. Is this out of 20? Did they increase the level cap for everything? No, right? No, everything's still level 10. Why is this level cap's level 20? Whatever. Uh, may or may not be me going crazy, but I'm pretty sure that thing's level cap is level 20. Why is it level 20? I'm very confused. Whatever, not important. I'm not gonna keep upgrading it. Uh, but yeah, so new cookie, I believe. No, there's not. Never mind. I guess there's a new cookie coming out soon. Uh, yeah, I don't think there's anything else all that crazy. It's still chapter one of the Odyssey stuff. There's no new story. I didn't miss anything all that crazy. Just a lot of things that were crazy. Uh, but yeah, so last time we left off, chapter 14, we just started. I don't think it's been nerfed yet. No, it looks to be just as hard and brutal as every... as, um usual, I suppose. Uh, let's actually just start with some of my free gotcha draws here, uh, and then I think I'm gonna take a look at the Odyssey and try a little bit, just a couple times, on Chapter 14. If it goes well, that is awesome. If it doesn't, that kind of sucks. Hey, we got a five draw and costume draw, so let's start with this, actually. Um, but yeah, definitely let me know if you guys want to see some more Quick and Kingdom videos. Again, don't really know why I stopped, but I'd be happy to play some more if you guys want to see it. I think a big part of the reason I stopped is, honestly, uh, they weren't doing as well as they used to. Quick and Kingdom, um, I guess almost probably like seven or eight months ago now uh, was really big on my channel. It was one of my more popular uh, series and videos for Quick and Kingdom videos. And then that sort of just stopped, and I don't really know why, uh, but it did, and it kind of sucked, and the views went downhill, so I stopped playing it. Because uh, I wasn't entirely I didn't feel like I was making a ton of progress, and obviously you guys weren't watching it as much as you used to. But I'm back, we'll see. It depends on how well this video does. Uh, if you guys want to see the video come back, or if you want to see Cookie and Kingdom as a series come back, give the video a like, leave a comment, hashtag bring back Cookie and Kingdom. Uh, you don't have to say that, but feel free to. Uh, but yeah, so that's it. Is this new? I don't think this is new. I'm pretty sure this is old story. I don't think any of this is all that new. Though honestly, I really don't remember all that well. It certainly could be. Uh, we'll get our necessities package. And then let us start off with just one attempt on chapter 14. I believe this is not the build I was doing last time. I'm still using Sobe Shark here. Uh, I think I'm good with Licorice. I want to give this one shot here. I believe this is the strategy I was using. I'll just try once. If I win, awesome. If I lose, not surprising. But I'll give a one shot here just to take a look. And after this, we'll go into the Cookie Odyssey stuff. I will go through this story because I need a refresher. <laughs> Let us raise our cups. A day like this deserves no less than the finest. I even took the liberty of adding five sugar cubes to each cup of coffee. What do you think? I have to say, this is most sweet and soft. But I'm unsure if we are deserving of this majestic feast. Oh, do not fret. From now on, this castle and all the lands around it belong to me. Dark Cacao Cookie was dealt with by Dark Choco Cookie, who I assume was gone as soon as his mission was completed. Don't think that was the case. I believe he's sticking around trying to find 
Uh, Dr. Cow Cookie Soul Jam is the story. Such a tragic loss of the respected Dr. Cacao King. That's why I stepped up to become their new ruler. <laughs> Thanks to your political genius, we can enjoy all these delights. But tell us, how did you manage to prepare all this food? Let's just say there was some spare coin in the royal treasury. The late king was too stingy when it came to spending. That is one of many improvements the Dark Cacao Kingdom will see under my rule. Sweetened meals for sugar-loving citizens. Entertainment for those seeking amusement. Through wise and benevolent policies, I will make all cookies in this kingdom able to spend their days happy and free. Hmm. But will the cookies be able to accept that? They are known for their rigidness and austerity. Then, those who disagree will be banished to the giant icing ridge. This doesn't sound very good. Uh, I don't really remember this being how it ended. I thought there wasn't as much story here, but there seems to be a lot here. Hapogato cookie! We have intruders! Right, the main cookies, our main cookie squad, uh, led by Gingerbread himself, uh, were breaking into the castle, I believe, to send a message to Dark Cow Cookie, because I don't think they know he's dead yet. Or maybe dead. What? No, it's not him. The king is no more, and, and the prince has gone. Yes. It's a group of outlanders speaking nonsense. One moment they claim the Great Wall has fallen. The next, that they've come to meet Dark Cow Cookie. Sugar for brain back upon. Get rid of them. No, 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 no. From now on, no one is allowed in the Black Citadel without my explicit permission. Yes, my lord. Oh, I need another cup of sweet coffee. Most of my life, I spent down on my knees. Even the moments I was allowed to sit in a chair, none of them were spent in comfort. If only I had known the royal throne would be so comfortable, I would have tried to become king earlier. <laughs> okay, well, I know why I keep skipping that every time I tried the stage before. That is long, like, really, really long. I don't really know why, uh, but it definitely is. Uh, you know, I'm pretty sure this stage is really brutal and I stand, like, no chance of beating it, but hey, why not give it a shot? There's no real reason as far as I'm concerned not to, so... Let's try it. There's no real reason not to. I just repeated that. I don't know why. Uh, pretty sure we are gonna lose, but I don't really see any reason not to again, which I've now repeated for the third time. Apparently I have nothing else to say. Uh, but I feel like we... At least I want to give this a shot, if nothing else. Even if we're gonna lose horribly, uh, it's worth trying. And then we can move into the Cookie Odyssey stuff and get some more story. Uh, which is probably mostly what's gonna be in today's video. Um, because I don't really know what else I want to do in this. There's not as much new stuff as I thought. I thought there was actually something new. It doesn't actually look like there's even been an update since the last time I played. Witness Which isn't exactly all that surprising, it's been a month, falter. but I don't know. This game gets updated pretty frequently, so I was expecting something new, but it doesn't look like it. Which, honestly, as far as I'm concerned, not all that bad of thing. Means I took a break and pretty much nothing changed. That's a pretty good situation. I believe there is a new cookie about to come out, though. Also, did I think did I think that? I, I have to listen to that back in editing, because I can't tell if that sounded really dumb, or if that was very funny. Uh, but I'm pretty sure they know this stage, but they made Chapter 14 easier. Because this is, like, really easy, and I doubt it's because I'm playing really well. It could be, and it looks like we're still dead, actually, so hold on a second. I may be speaking way too quickly here. Yep, I'm speaking way too early. Never mind. Forget everything I just said. This stage is still brutal. Uh, but we did significantly better than I thought we were, so... I don't know, I got confident, but no, it looks just as hard as normal. Because this is what happened. We made it to the boss, and then the boss destroyed us, because the boss was really strong. Okay, yeah, no, I'm not trying that again this today. Maybe if we do another video, I will try it then. Uh, still need to level up my cookies, which I might be able to do, I don't really know. Let's head to the Cookie Odyssey, not here. Let's head to the cookie... That's still the wrong area. Let's head to the Cookie Odyssey. Yes, we are doing all these quests here. I feel like there's new stuff here, but I don't know. Let's just go to the various areas and continue on with however many feather things I have left. And that'll probably be... No, I'll, let's do that, and then we'll see what I want to do after that. Uh, Pure Vanilla Cookie's Chamber. Pure Vanilla Cookie. Knock, knock. You there? Or here, I guess. 
Uh, looks like Pia Vanilla has left all, has already left. What a busy cookie. The candle by Pia Vanilla Cookie's bed has burned to a stump. Looks like he remained awake until very late. Hmm. Is something troubling him? There is a white lily in the vase by the candle. The entire room is filled with white lily scent. This makes me think of Clue, and I don't know why. This feels like a murder scene. And I really can't tell why, but this is very fun. Okay, interesting. I'm going to look at the white lily greenhouse now. I'm assuming there are other areas of this, but I don't know. Supposedly, we're only like 2% of the way through this, but I honestly don't even see all the much more stuff that we could do. But let's, I guess, just keep looking. We can do one more here, and then I'll we'll have to do some quests. I can hardly believe it. I will be reunited with my dearest friends any moment now. Okay, so we get some voice acting again. I still don't know why only parts of this have voice acting. I guess it's the most important parts, but still, seems a little odd to me now that it's been almost a month. Do you think they would have added that by now? But, guess not. I hope the journey here wasn't too difficult. And we haven't seen each other for such a long time. How should I greet them? What should I say? And I... I must tell them who Dark Enchantress Cookie truly is. They're going to be devastated. Is there no way of telling them the truth without hurting them? <sighs> the lilies are more silent than usual today. Pure Vanilla Cookie! There you are! Ginger Brave! Oh, I am so glad you came. Please, welcome. I have great news. My old friends are on their way to the Vanilla Kingdom. I haven't felt so much joy and excitement in many, many years. Whoa, that's amazing! You must have missed them a lot. I'm so happy for you! Why, yes. But if only the purpose of this reunion were as happy. I requested their presence because there is a rather heavy topic to discuss. Dark Enchantress Cookie is preparing for another war. Troubling things are happening as we speak. Magical rifts are shattering the sky, and the followers of Dark Enchantress Cookie are rising all over Earthbread. We cannot stand by and witness our kingdoms crumble one by one. That is why I have summoned the other cookies. We must devise a plan to stop this threat once and for all. Ginger Brave, you have done a lot to help those in need all across Earthbread. This very kingdom owes its existence to none other but you. My friend, please share your selfless courage with us all at the upcoming council. Of course! Easy! You can always count on me! Okay, not all that surprising. Ginger Ray, by the looks of it, is heading to the, uh, what's it called? It's the, um, Creme Republic, I think? I think it's that, uh, but I'm not quite sure. It's some council of the old Vanilla Kingdom that left before the Dark Flowers War, or Dark Flower Wars, um, or War. It might have been singular. I think there were multiple, I don't know. Uh, but it looks like this is going to be kind of interesting. I feel like there's still a lot of deception in the story. I remember in the first video, you know, my last Cookie and Kingdom video, uh, there were a lot of characters in Shadow that they tried to, like, hide. So I think this really is a big plan for the game's future. I'm kind of curious to see what's going to happen. What's going to add, what they're going to do to make it, like, to enter you into the plot. You have my gratitude, Ginger Brave. But now, Hollyberry Cookie and Dark Cacao Cookie will be here any minute. Huh. I guess this kind of tells you Dark Cacao, Dark Cacao Cookie's kind of alive, huh? Yeah, probably. I sort of did figure so, but I guess here's our answer. I don't know, Chapter 14 still seems impossible to me. I'm sure it'll get nerfed eventually, or I'll finally level up my cookies and I'll be able to beat it, but for the time being, this isn't that surprising. I will head over to the Solarium of Unity and help with the preparations. Meanwhile, may I ask you to give my friends a warm welcome? It would help me tremendously if you showed them to the accommodations we prepared. Awesome. Okay, so what's next? Uh, we're going back to the garden. Can I afford this? I cannot cost 13. So we need to do some quests quickly. Some of these are pretty easy. Play three times in the arena. Let's speed run this. Boom. I haven't played in the arena in ages. I'm going to get nothing, but this should take me literally one second, even with one cookie. My low-level sorbet shark cookie. You can finish this real quickly, bud. I'm pretty sure you can one-shot everyone. Yeah, awesome. <laughs> Playing through arena battles is fairly easy, especially when you're in the absolute bottom league, because, you know, haven't played in a month again. Uh, but yeah, so we'll try to get one more or two more of these stories in quickly by completing some of these quests, because they should be pretty easy to beat. Um, or to do, rather. And then, yeah, I mean, I'm definitely open for suggestions of what you guys want to see if you guys do want to see some more of this game. 
what do you want me to do in the videos? I still don't know. I've been asking this question since I first started playing this game um, over a year ago, a long time ago, like a year and a half ago now. But I really don't know what I want to do with this game still, what you guys want to see in this game. I've had mixed success. Some of my more popular videos of this are gotcha videos, some are story driven. Uh, very spread out and what ones do more success. Obviously, update videos generally do pretty well. Uh, but I don't know what you guys want to see, so I definitely need you guys' opinions. I pro should probably do some polls. I haven't done a poll in a while. I'll probably set one or two of those up and uh, see if I can get some help from you guys there. Uh, for the time being, Odysseys, that should be enough for one more bit of story. Maybe a short one, but let's collect the quest. We can always do more later. Two out of 200, and I believe you can only do 10 a day, I think is how it works, but I'm not quite sure. Let's take a look at the next bit of story. The Vanilla Kingdom, my lady. Wildberry Cookie. I can't remember if we met her, or him, uh, last time, rather. Uh, but I don't know if we met him yet. I don't think so. Listen, can you hear it? I bet you can't. <laughs> the Vanilla Kingdom has always been too peaceful and quiet. <laughs> ah, but look at those cookies, all happy and crispy. Marvelous, just marvelous. <laughs> Hollyberry Cookie, you're here! State your purpose. Uh, is Wildberry Cookie her bodyguard? I guess so. I'm assuming he's from her kingdom, but I don't actually know. I thought he was kind of part of the Vanilla Kingdom, but I guess it would make more sense if he was associated with the Hollyberry Kingdom. Hold your berries there. Ginger Brave is a friend, and also a friend of my granddaughter. Young Ginger Brave. Our glasses clinked back in the Hollyberry Kingdom, remember? It's been a while. <laughs> Do you guys find it odd? So, Custer Cookie is the great-grandson of Pure Vanilla Cookie. Princess Cookie is the granddaughter of Hollyberry Cookie. And then Dark Chocolate Cookie is the son of Dark Cacao Cookie. It just feels a little odd. I guess it shows the difference in age between Dark Choco, Princess, and Custard. But it still seems odd to me. The juice was awesome. <laughs> it's so good to see you. But who are all these cookies with you? Wait, wasn't the, like, fruit juice in the Oliver Kingdom, didn't that poison Wizard Cookie and Strawberry Cookie and, like, mind control them? I feel like that happened. Uh, that's a little odd, but okay, Ginger Babe, okay. A little suspicious. This one here is Wildberry Cookie, my escort. Naturally, I would be perfectly fine on my own, but <laughs> you know how Jungleberry Cookie is. She insisted. <laughs> okay, I, I guess that makes sense. Guess what? Wildberry Cookie suggested that we bring even more cookies with us. I tried to argue, but this chum simply put his foot down. <laughs> <clears throat> Pleased to meet you. Now, now, at ease, Wildberry Cookie. The more, the merrier. Every cookie here is sweet and crunchy as they come. You'll become friends in no time. <laughs> I'm sure of it. Welcome to the Vanilla Kingdom. Uh, so I guess that answers the question about, um, what's his face? Wildberry Cookie, definitely a bodyguard. I'll show you around. Pure Vanilla Cookie prepared special rooms for everyone. Follow me. Okay, so I quickly want to see if we can do one more of these before we run off. No, I do not want to buy something. Uh, how many do we need feather-wise? We need 11 feathers, so how can I get that pretty easily? Send one balloon expedition. Boom. Easy. No problem. That takes literally five seconds. It all requires me to do is press this button. Quest complete. Uh, we do need to do one more though because that only takes us to a total of 11, sadly enough. Uh, at least I think that's only 11, or 10 rather. 10 and we need 11. We need 11, right? Yeah, okay, so we'll go back to Holly Cookie's chamber, Hollyberry Cookie's chamber. We just need to do one more. Complete a bounty of level 10 or higher. Again, fairly easy. We have quite a few of these unlocked in level 10. And as soon as I fix my build real quick here, uh, this shouldn't be a very difficult thing Curious to do, just, um, where's of. my other cookie? Cotton cookie, boom. Uh, I should probably equip some treasures too, this shouldn't be that easy, I believe the level 10, uh, bounty quests aren't exactly a joke, but they're still not that hard, so let's just take a look here, this should be pretty easy, um, I'm assuming so? I, I'm gonna turn it off auto, why, why do I need it? I don't know, auto. Don't know what I'm saying here, but yeah, it's been a while, uh, these level 10 quests I know weren't in the game when they first came out, but I think it was added pretty quickly, I wanna say in when chapter 11 and 12 came out is when uh, level 10 bounties came out but i don't actually know i just remember one day they were here and i was like okay i guess that's cool 
Uh, but at that point in the game, honestly, the thing Banshee gave, the, like, skill powders, I didn't need very badly. I had a lot of them. Uh, and I was mostly in need for XP jellies, so it wasn't a big deal. But, hey, pretty easy, as you can probably tell. This is definitely not that strong. This boss is... Okay, that's 100,000 up. I thought it was 10k for a second, which would have been super sad. 100,000, it's a little more reasonable. Still way too easy, but a little more reasonable. Uh, with that, though, we have one more quest completed, and we should be able to do one Where last bit of story before we end off foe? today, so that's what I will quickly do. Back once again to the Cookie Odyssey. I still love this. This is so cool. Just a lot of, like, story combined. My absolute favorite part of Cookie and Kingdom. Uh, here we go. Last story. Well, strike me down. These are my chambers? Gorgeous. Simply gorgeous. Oh, pure vanilla cookie, you didn't have to. And I have just the bottle of berry juice befitting all this luxury. Please put your glass down, my lady. The council is about to start. With all due respect, Jungleberry Cookie specifically requested to make sure that your highness doesn't... overindulge in berry juice. Uh, always a little funny when they try to make references to, like, alcohol and stuff in games. And they're just like, oh, don't, don't have too much berry juice. And you should change your name to Nagging Berry Cookie. <laughs> ah, young Ginger Brave, thank you for your help. We'll head to the Vanilla Castle once we finish settling down. Okay, so that's cool. Next, we're in the garden. Again, this is, again, right? You cost 20, so you're actually a rather expensive garden. Hmm, I guess I'll have to do some quests on my own. Anyways, we do have quickly one or two events here to get, so that's awesome. Uh, what are these from? Oh, it's just, you just get these stuff for free. I forgot about that. Uh, but yeah, so that's cool. Uh, got a few more wards here, which is awesome. Always appreciated. New season. Sounds about right. Uh, but yeah, just thank you all for watching. If you guys do want to see some more Cookie and Kingdom, once again, please give the video a like, leave a comment, um, try to get other people to watch it. I don't know. Uh, subscribe if you haven't yet. Also, to join the Pop Elfin Squad. I really do appreciate it. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye!